The eyes can be used as a powerful tool to define your assertiveness. When you maintain eye contact with others during the conversation, you are telling them that you are sincere and interested in what they have to say. It also proves that you are strong and confident. This will allow you to be treated seriously and increase your power to influence others. Even though your parents and grandparents may not have known the modern definition of assertiveness, they intuitively felt that it was right to adopt a straight posture with your shoulders thrown back and your head held high. They knew that your posture determined whether you were in command or not, and that is why they reprimanded you every time you slouched. Obey these wise words and it becomes easier to behave assertively and achieve your goals. People may formulate their opinion of you based solely on the way you dress, stand, walk, and shake hands. If you get it right the first time, it will set the stage for fruitful discussions. When you greet someone, make sure your hand is dry and kept in a vertical position as this would convey strength and character. When you talk, make sure your body is dancing in alignment with the message. Open your arms and show your palms to convey sincerity and agreement and to welcome the others to participate. Bow slightly and use the palm up gesture when asking for something and others will comply willingly. If you use the palm down gesture or your index finger, they would most likely ignore you as these gestures portray a condescending attitude. Folding the arms is generally considered to have a negative connotation and should be avoided during a friendly discussion. However, you may use it to show your disagreement when someone has become too snippy or aggressive. This is when you allow your body to represent you. Assertive people turn their whole bodies towards their interlocutors and subtly emulate their nonverbal signals. This creates the feeling of affinity and harmony. Remember, they like you if you look like them.